Okay, should be in theory live. And if we're not, then I'm sad. Hang on a minute. Okay, so through Streamlabs, I've re signed into my account and now next to the um, next, next to this is not good at all. Next to where my uh, my stream desktop where I've got like a little chat thing that's supposed to pop up. Instead, now I've got a bloody uh, that um, a bloody ad playing for like something. Let's get it. Let's get it to my my channel, and then we'll leave it at that. I think is probably the best way to put it. We'll put it onto the stream, and then we'll forget it exists. Because this way, it's just, it's just a pain in the ass. I don't know what happened there. I'm sorry. How are we all doing? It's me. Okay. Hello. How are we doing? Sorry, it was fucked. It, it was just absolutely fucked is what it was then. Let's, uh... I can actually see my chat in the chat menu here now. That's weird. Okay, where's my controller? Okay, Red Dead Redemption 2. We're going to do some open world stuff. I need to unmute my microphone. Wow. No, well, actually, my desktop audio is what needs unmuting, but it's already done. And my microphone is too. So we are here. We're in the, um where we were in that video I made this is um, Sonny's shack here's Sonny he did a bit of raping and so I introduced him to a bit of dying he's now got a hole for a mouth I'm sure he'll I'm sure he'll enjoy haunting whoever comes next uh, come on can we just get rid of his head Head this to the one to explode. I think I've done him in. Look at how disturbing that actually is. Look at that. That that was a man. Now it is a dead. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna do some exploring. So if there's anything that you want us to look at, like say anything you can't quite make heads or tails of. Or anything like that that you don't really understand, like in the world. That would be fascinating. There was a guy who commented, if a place just shows the location but doesn't show any names and details on the map, then you haven't been there. And that's clearly a lie. So there's a lot of places that don't show those details. So let's, the, let's plot them a course for across them. That's Facebook in the background. I'm going to have to close that because otherwise we're about to get absolutely swarmed with with um dings and dings and dings we're gonna go across the map and if anybody wants me to go anywhere in specific let me know in the comment section yeah well the, the chat you know it's the, the surest way go to arthur's grave absolutely let's do that shall we shall we go to arthur's grave I'm trying to remember where is arthur's grave Micah's Hideout, Amberino, Tempest Rim. It's not there. It's let's let's have a look at it on a map. I'm gonna Google Arthur's grave location just for you. Okay, so it's over. So the, it's wherever the mysterious hill home is, really, isn't it? It is. There's the mysterious hill home. And in theory, it's along. So near the mysterious hill home, isn't it? Arthur's grave. It's more or less in the same spot. I'm gonna go to the fort in Mexico. I don't know if you can still get into Mexico. Oh, shit, that's the thing. There's creatures in this place. Oh god, I'm surprised my horse just didn't wind up in a death roll with alligators because it appears as if there were three of them. <laughs> How's everybody doing in my chat, anyways? Um, Please do drop a like, that would be much appreciated. If you're new, hit subscribe. Um, and if you want to check out the Patreon stuff, then I'll leave it. Well, I mean, there is a link in the description. Don't feel forced to, but there's some extra content over there. Just getting my PR stuff out of the way, so nobody cries about the fact that I don't do it. Feed your horse, damn it. Oh, yeah, you're right. Well, you see what happened was, the horse likes hay. I need to refilm a cause. Okay, if you don't know what happened, I went and did the... I did a uh, mission. No, not a mission. Sorry, I did the um, the sunny encounter. And what happens in the sunny encounter is nothing good. 
So what happens is you get knocked out and then you lose all your cores. Your cores just vanish. I need the assorted biscuits to sort out my cores. And I need to sort out a bit of stamina. That was... And now I need to go feed my horse a bit of hay. And then my cores will be reset, won't it? Well, sorry, beets will do it. Now my horse is happy. There we go. You can go to Mexico. Can the KKK hang Micah? In theory, I guess? What's this place? There's, I mean, you can't get in. You can tell the location you can't gain access to. It's all boarded up. Well, I am in the bayou still, aren't I? I'm not travelling anywhere near as quickly as I'd like. Play the campaign. That's not what the purpose of the stream is, though. We're, we're doing some open world exploration. We're going to have an adventure. And it's going to be great. That felt good. Now, the thing is though, if you stick around after these shootouts, I find you get bounty regardless of what you do. So you can't stick around because it draws attention. But I want to loot these guys because they've got a they've got a bit of dough on them. Well, they have much, but they might have things in ha that will come in handy against maybe lesser enemies later on. These are Hamish. I do need to visit Hamish. Yes. Come on, man. Are you going to play PC Red Dead 2? Oh, yes, I'm absolutely pumped for PC Red Dead 2. I put a 1080 Ti in this machine just for that. Just for Red Dead 2, I put that thing in there. I was on a 1060 before, and I thought, you know what? Now's as good a time as any to put that 1080 Ti I've had for months in. So that's exactly what I did. I put it in. I do believe I should probably consider reapplying thermal paste before before the, that time for some reason. Because I noticed um, when I was streaming a week or so ago, and a bit of throttling. But... I don't know if that will really fix it, or if that's necessary, to be honest. Because I don't like to faff with my PC unless it's absolutely necessary. Because I find that PCs will break a lot easier than they'll fix. <laughs> Hamish is on... I, I haven't done the final mission for Hamish yet, on this one. You know, then I found this cabin of sorts just north of the Iron Amberino. That's two dead men and a gun you can pick up. Don't know if you've seen it before, though. Amberino. I want to know if I have, because, where's, oh, uh, oh, it's along here, just above the Owen Amberino. This could be that rail cabin, couldn't it, or is it, there's the loft, you mean this area here, I guess, sort of thing, what's that, why is there a little dot there, can't wait for Red Dead Redemption 2 PC, got it pre-ordered and all, oh yes, shame, <laughs> It's all pre-ordered. I want to. I don't know if we can pre-install. I haven't checked. Probably not. What's this? Just a. Hang on. Is there something in that? Is my eyes playing tricks on me? I found revolver cartridges. I am clever. I am God, and I am really happy about that. Oh, we don't need gun oil. Okay, cool. You find some really strange things in this game. Sometimes you'll just find people blow themselves up just for no reason. Like just out of nowhere, they just show up and kill themselves like a bunch of idiots. Now, the only thing that I that I was looking at today, which for some reason reminded me of Red Dead in the most weird way possible, was I watched a video of Americans thermiting Elmo. Like an Elmo toy. They wound it up and they lit up um, 
you know, a stick of dynamite from one end and then they just watched it sort of charge down as Elmo's doing a dance and then midway through he just explodes his head just goodbye and then he catches fire and dies, it's great. It's also the most American video I think I've ever seen on YouTube, but I do love it. What horse is that? This is a... This is an Arabian. Um, a white Arabian. I know it doesn't look like one because I have it. It does need a bit of brushing, to be fair to him. But it is a white Arabian. Ready to play Red Dead Redemption 2 on console. So close to PC release. I feel if I played, I'll be burned out by the time PC release comes. I mean... For me, it's about that graphical look. I'm kind of, you know, I'm just pumped, but I'm not too pumped. Like I don't care much because I've played it, so part of the magic is gone there. Um, my my enjoyment is purely going to be fucking about with the technology and having a great time. And of course, I'll probably want to do like a comparison between PS4 Pro and PC, won't I? If I can. If you visit, if you visit Hamish, I'm trying to get his horse fuel. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry, I, I, I have to, sorry, I have to be already half asleep. That's fine. Take it easy and have a good sleep. Uh, hey, hello, a heel mater. The rose, grey Arabian is better, is it? Cool. I see Ethan Hall subscribed. What a guy. An absolute wild character. Do you think The Witcher 3 is okay for 14 year olds? Is it worse than Rhythm 2? Because I already have that. Honestly, it's. I don't really know about these age things. The age rating on the game is 18 in the UK, or mature, or whatever. But, you know, when you're of that age, if your parents. If your parents don't mind, what do it matter? Mate. It's all about whether or not your parents allow it. And if they do, then yeah. The buying age is my advice. That thing took a lot of shots. It's going to be a very poor skin. As if he's just died. Poor wolf pelt. Let's put it down because it's not useful. He's just passed away on me. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Off he goes. Don't want to loot him, because that would be shit. It's fine, horse. Relax. That's why my horse is special. That's the hill home. Arthur's grave is above it. So that means I need to find a way up. Which usually means by going around. Now this is the first location we're visiting. It's a big adventure. Come on, horse. None of this. Sometimes the horse just refuses to move and it annoys me. You always find that, um... You can't shoot it. You can't shoot it. You can't shoot the thing that was on Arthur's grave. When it flies off, you cannot shoot it. Oh my god. Wow, that's really cool, actually. Arthur Morgan. I like Arthur's grave. It's nice. I just find it funny how you can't shoot the creature that sits on it. 
that means that it's related to Arthur in the sense that it's always there by design it's a symbolic thing and in John's mind it, it has something to do with Arthur basically they want you to think that that, that bird that flies off is Arthur, it's great maybe that's Arthur that flew away yeah I think that's the, I think that's the point Arthur's spirit animal is either a deer or a wolf isn't it depends on your honour uh, okay, where do we go next? Yes, Eagle Flies, I think. Oh, Eagle Flies sitting on his grave having a shit. Yeah, that seems about right. Um, is it Hamish? Hamish, where are you, boy? It's not on here. Uh, I guess we're going elsewhere for now. In before the theories, the bird has reincarnated Arthur. Pee on the grave. Look at this thing, it's magical. So I'll tell you what direction to go into to find weirdness. That one. Look at the lighting. I sure cannot wait to play this on PC, I'm telling you now. Okay, where do I want to go? It's this place. Seems well out the way. Why are you playing as John? Oh shit, I've just run into a bloody... Yeah, well that makes perfect sense. I love collisions in this game. And why is the horse being a fucking spaz? Let's do this the old fashioned way. There's no other way to go. I guess we just have to die. God damn it. Maybe I should no never have dared to climb. Okay, well that was a mess. Smoking grep, smoking grep. Come on sir. This fucking retard horse. There's no way off that really. You have to just sort of do that. I find it unusual how he's buried here, but he was more, where was it, the camp was more here. I mean, the, they made a lot of ground, to be fair, in that end. That wall, Charles buried him elsewhere. And David's a bot. That took its time, didn't it? And we got it done. Was the context for Uncle Ben's rice? friend of mine was playing Red Dead Online and then it, and um, my mate Cameron watched him run up to some random guy in Saint Denis and um, shout Uncle Ben's rice and it was truly magnificent and we've never stopped talking about it ever since. It's become, it's become a call if you will. Imagine this in 60 FPS and like 4K. It's going to be magnificent. Not that my PC can handle 4K. Well, I mean, it probably could, but I don't have a 4K monitor, so it won't. It's my answer. Not that I'm going to play in 4K, but just imagine how it's going to look. Which 
just the same at 60 frames. My god. If that is if it's possible. That is if this, this PC is not a spaz and does me well. I'm already picturing it. I can't wait for this game to drop to PC. I'm going to have a fat wank over it tonight. Don't forget to leave a like on the stream, share with your friends, hit subscribe if you're new, that would be magnificent. Do, 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 do. Sorry, I had to. If we jump in that, we drown. It's kind of obvious. Do you want to know why? Because we're John Marston. We cannot swim. I do find it kind of funny that they, they allow you to do it in the main game. Well, in the main part of the game. But when we get to the epilogue, you, ne you can never do it again. You can never swim. That being said, if you run out of stamina while swimming is Arthur, he too drowns. And also, there's nothing of interest that comes from swimming in this game anyway. So, it's really kind of like a... It's just a feature they could put there, so they did. I'm going to wank off now. You look tired, Fishy. It's been a long day. And I thought I'd stream just because I could. And I, I felt like it. And it felt like a, a good way to spend the time that I was just going to sit down and chill watching Netflix with if I wasn't going to stream. And honestly, I can watch Netflix later. It's just one of those ones. I have the time free. I can stream. So here I am. You're all welcome. But I haven't opted simply to Netflix. It, who, who lives here then? What if I sleep in this random tent that I've discovered? Will I get attacked? All hail the Basmati right strain. I mean, yes. I'm in some rando's tent. It's like a new journal entry. There's a bl there's like a fly zapper thing. What do you watch on Netflix? Oh, I don't know at the moment. I'm trying to look for things to watch. So in theory, doing this is a win-win. I'm a sucker for westerns, but when it comes to western films, I'm always on Sky Cinema. So other because I've got Sky Q. So instead of like going onto Netflix, the house has Sky Q. We have a a, Q bo a, a mini box in here. We have a, the big box downstairs. There's another mini box in my brother's bedroom. And at the moment, and I, I like a good western. Um, I think the uh, I think a few weeks ago on Snapchat, I posted a few um, heinous Snapchat stories about Once Upon a Time in the West, where I was adding filters to the characters' faces, which, for the record, should be considered a war crime. But I was doing it because I I, I thought it was funny. Uh, but also last night, I was watching a film on Sky Cinema. A good old 1998 classico, The Legend of Zorro. So just imagine Puss in Boots from Shrek, but as a human, because that's exactly what it is. Because it's the exact same actor as well. And it was all right. It's not really a Western, though. It's more like a Mexican sort of Western. So it is, it is a Western, but it's also not. It's like an action film. It was weird. What's the stream? I just watched the what's it called High Noon. High Noon is that the um? No, that's Tombstone. I'm thinking of the one where it's um. What's his name? Forget it. Wyatt Earp and company, and the gunfight of OK Corral. I need to get something on that is actually weather appropriate, don't I? Just I wish the horse would stop. Hide your identity while committing your crimes. <laughs> while committing crimes. Now we're all kitted out. 
much better. Blood breaking bad. You should do a Red Dead Redemption 2 proper call, go to every bar and every settlement and have a drink in every bar in the, in the game. Yeah, but by the time I'm at the end, I'll be stone sober in the game anyway because um, you sober up in like seconds. Are you talking about me going to every bar in the game and when I get there having a drink physically because I'd rather die than drink myself silly? I can't think of anything worse. Why have I got only so much ammunition in slug? Okay, it's because it's slug and not that. Hateful Eight is it. The Hateful Eight is, um... Yeah, well, I mean, I mean, there's a difference between a Western and a Tarantino film, though, isn't there, really? It's a fantastic film. But I wouldn't necessarily call it a Western. But it's, all, it's a Western set. Tarantino film. For all intents and purposes, it's an amazing Tarantino film, but it's just so unique from everything else that I don't really want to categorise it as a Western. But I love The Hateful Eight. It's such a good film. And I don't just say that because a character gets shot in the balls, but... So it's up. So, this place is just a burned down hut in the middle of the snow. Wow, how bleak. I came all this way to be disappointed thoroughly. There's Adler Ranch. There's Iglesia. There's Coulter. There's that place. Now, where we want to go is... Why don't, we go, why don't we go here? Have a little explore. Do you know that the horse gets shot in the balls it's dark? Oh, fuck me. I just rode straight into a tree because I was reading a chat message about a horse getting shot in the balls it dies. I mean, if you got shot in the balls, there's a good chance that you'd probably die. I mean, it's survivable, sure, but if you need medical attention quite quickly. Oh, Tom's blind, really close to straw, but there's a ten graves. Now I'm drinking Mountain Dew and eating Domino's. Now that's a way to go, isn't it? I was imagining you having glasses, Lamau. One second. Well, now you don't have to imagine it. Oh, it really hurts the eyes. I mean, I do, my left eye kind of is a bit wonky, so I can just don these, and it's fine, and I'll look like, well, a worse version of myself. But I do have, my, my eyesight isn't, it isn't a problem for me, really. But I can don these if you want me to, for now. When I, when I got these about a year or two ago, my mother said to me, you look like you've worn glasses all your life, and I'm not sure if that's backhanded or what, but... really weird disorienting is what it is because it corrects my left eye but it does nothing for my right look it's grandpa fishy imagine me no longer i am glasses fishy no i've had glasses for a couple of years now but I, d I don't need to wear them very often because my eyesight is fine it's just my left eye is a bit lazy sometimes so it can't really it can distinguish shapes, colours, etc. just the same as the other eye, but it doesn't do so well with words, and I can't explain it. I think it's just very long-sighted. And glasses, because I'm so dependent on my right eye, I don't think my glasses really, really correct it as well as you'd hope. Oh, shit me. Come on. I love that. You know, when you're in the middle of a chase, what happens is the horse, as it struggles with you, 
it chooses where to go a little bit. You have less control over it. It's like it's really disorienting, especially when you're wearing glasses that you haven't worn in a couple weeks. Which is never needed to. Jeez, Dave. Someone just said the word chim. Yeah, a lot of the kind of guy who'll get mad at you for saying the word Morrowind wrong. Oh, is this place? Oh, no, is there a way up there? And to Mr. Black and Mr. White's little... How do they get up there? What the fuck? Go your way up. Well, you do anything for Red Dead 2 on PC. It's coming to PC, so we don't have to do anything. So, let's uh, get rid of those. Because I can see screens better without them. I'm going to be honest. Those walls want me dead. Be wanted starting in Tumbleweed and run to something the on foot while having a bounty. That's impossible. Or probable. Or I just don't want to do it. Okay, Strawberry, you said a place. Let's have a little agenda to the stable near Strawberry. Because I personally didn't think there was a stable in Strawberry. Shows how much I pay attention. That's to be Spider-Man to get up there. In case you haven't noticed, they're probably up there. And that thing that goes across the front of their, like, their little um, balcony up there is a ladder that they've raised so that nobody can get up there while they're there. So you just need to have the ladder down. So they'd probably just use the ladder, which the game doesn't script the way to get it down. Though I'd imagine there are several ways you could do it. I'm really good at not taking the road. I know that if I run through here, a bear will chase me. This is bear country. Go to Micah's old camp near Strawberry. Well, the one on Mount Hagen. Yeah, I've accidentally fucked this because now I'm on the top of this thing. I'm about to rejoin a road. Play Mario 64. Ooh, shout. Game theory with fishy. Ooh. That would be fascinating, but it'll never happen, will it? Get a covered wagon, see if you can hop on. Hop up. That would do it, to be fair. So in theory, I need to steal the, um, the little, yeah, wagon. Games are bad for kids, are they? Well, honestly, it keeps the kids off the streets where they get stabbed. Play some games. Enjoy your life. Play some gaming. Nothing wrong with a bit of gaming. The taxidermist house. Yes. Everyone loves the taxidermist house. It's not my favourite place in the world. Because that lady takes the piss. Watch it. What? In GTA 5, Lester has back pains, and in Red Dead, Uncle Ed's Lumbago, and they both look the same. Yeah, Rockstar love their jokes. They love their running jokes, they do. Never knew there was a stable here. I forgot about it. That or they, they've just they just added it at some point. Maybe I'm just a return. It's entirely possible. We're an aim horse. We're gonna bring back Megatron. 
love that that's the suggested word. Negatron. That's a hell of a name. What do you mean she's only worth a hundred and eighty dollars? That's crazy. Can we upgrade Megatron? Can we make Megatron cool? In theory, we could, but there's no real point. Find a control of a Megatron. Autobots roll out. Oh, wait, hang on. No, no, Megatron's a Decepticon. Okay. So. Well, I really need a loo. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go have, a, have the finest of pisses. And in that time, you need to suggest where we go next. Just let me know where are we going next. And of course, I will be back probably within the minute. I'm pretty quick. Especially if I flash out that wank at super speed. Anyways, I'll, I'll be back in a minute. Please do let me know where shall we go next. Nobody's as fast as me. Well, there we go. Something or Tahiti. Uh, Hamish, Thieves Landing. Let's... No, I just can't read. You can't read every message. No, I, sh I just can't read. <laughs> just, uh, Alex is right. Let's go to Thieves Landing, because I haven't on this save. Let's do it. Thieves Landing. Da -da 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 -da. It's a good suggestion. Old gang camps. It, I might do those. That's an idea. <laughs> old Tom's blind. Where's that? Where's Old Tom's blind? Because that's nearby, isn't it? Don't know where Old Tom's blind is. Oh, there it is. I'm sure I've been there. Is that the house where when you go in, you get attacked by a bear? Either way, we're off to Thieves Landing. Plenty of time to come back to it. Don't worry. We should play The Long Dark. It's a quality survival game with a cheap price tag. It fits your style. Pretty cool. I like this place. This place is pretty cool as well. Got a viewing platform where they probably killed. They probably watched us do. Well, they probably observed. A little bit of um, re education of these good old natives. And then you have all these graves outside the back. There's, there's like 10 graves at Old Tom's Blind. Alright, we'll go check it out after we checked out Thieves Landing. Because I think... Jesus, Ethan. Prison Island. What's I, what have I done? What have I done wrong? Pete, do you like LNOR? I've got LNOR is still gold coming out tomorrow. Fort Wallace. Plenty of time. How would you want Odyssey to be removed from the Assassin's Creed canon? What? Oh, that Ethan. Okay. Back for college. Done everything now. Ready to go do some gaming. Oh, yes. Gamering. I knew this wouldn't be a cliff. You want to know why? Because this is a very flat sort of area. It's not stupidly flat. It's just flatter. Go to the old chapter camps. Don't worry. That's on the agenda to do. How long are we into the stream? That is what I want to know.
Go hunting for Skinners. Plenty of time to do that. Pretty sure I've already actually done it, but you know. He'll never respond to me. Yeah, you're probably right. But I'll try my artist. Free Hong Kong. Oh god, well done. You've just snuck a political message into this stream. I don't care. McFarlane's Ranch. I was there before and there was the uh, hearse and the vampire-like feeling about it. And this is the... You can tell I've never been here before. Put it kindly, there would not be loads of people here if I was... This is fun. Coming here was a great idea. I can't swim. He wants what's on the boat. What's on the boat? Now you have me really fascinated, boys. I didn't know there was anything on this boat. See, th this is how camps are done. Not like in Assassin's Creed Odyssey. There's like a risk of getting reinforcements and all chaos breaking loose. That's not possible here. It just, you know. It's just simple, you know, straight showdown sort of business. There's nothing else to it. Now, what's on this boat? There's gold inside the boat. Okay, how much gold? Clearly not too much, otherwise the boat would have sinketh. Do I know how I know that? Because gold is heavy, but not heavy enough to sink a boat. Unless the boat was full of it, then there's a good chance that it would just about do it. Ha ha, hit me. Far Cry 6 Africa. It's my favourite kind of Far Cry, that. Far Cry, Far Cry, oh, gold nuggets. Look at all that gold, wow. I'm going to sell this for 50 squid. Give me the compartment, don't worry. Is that it? Bill stack. Yes. Oh, where is that money? Mine. I don't know Del Lobo settled so far up north. It's not really that far north though, is it? It's kind of, it's kind of anything. It's just east. Well, that's an empty chest, isn't it? Well, that's a disappointment. Get used the boat to get in that house on stilts. Are you mad? How do you expect this to work, mate? Just, just out of curiosity, there's a chest with nothing in it. Is there another chest anywhere though? Wait, would you recommend Red Dead 2? Because I'm thinking of getting it. Absolutely, Jesus me! This is one of the one of those games that you just have to play. It's magnificent. Yeah. Malakas, you took gold. Remember you at 500 subs? Were you here at that time? Because that was years ago. That was absolutely years ago. You know. I am now. Shoot the lamp, fishy. Well, I was. That was worth it. I'm now going to climb out of the boat if that's okay with you. As you can see, that was one of my many great ideas. Listen to you. 
Should we do a full playthrough when I did it two on PC? I did a full playthrough on my channel already. I don't really feel like doing another full playthrough um, on the stream. I do feel like streaming it, you know, making a couple of videos, explaining my thoughts, etc. while playing the game myself and how my experience with the performance, etc. giving you a good rundown of just whether or not it's worth it for players who do have a console but want to play it on PC, as well as players who are new to it entirely, which is an obvious yes, but, you know. I want to break that down, maybe do like a little um, visual comparison if possible. Um... But I don't really know if streaming the entire thing is really something that I'm going to feel like doing. Not again. Because on stream, because of the bitrate of YouTube at 1080p, it will probably just look the exact same and you won't notice a difference. Besides from the fact that I'll be using an Xbox controller as opposed to a PlayStation 1 because they're easier to sync up to Microsoft um, software, I guess. I've absolutely freed Tumblesmeed. Tumblesmeed. This is um, Thieves Landing. Yeah, okay. Not worth it. This place is kinda not there yet in this game, is it? Sort of not an area, really, that you can do much at. So as far as the game's concerned, it's not as established as it becomes in Red Dead 1. So it's got a couple of years of development to go under yet. The Van Horn Saloon, there is a message that hints the location of the missing princess. The Van Horn Saloon. Yeah, well, first... I owe a man this. Let's go. Big adventure time. Dom can get very nice. I appreciate it if you didn't. Indeed. I back that message. Go get drunk with Lenny. In case you haven't noticed, Lenny is deceased. Don't forget to leave a like on the stream, share with your friends, hit subscribe if you're new. That would be magnificent. I need to sort out those cores, my god. Right. Go to Hamish, he is available. Alright, plenty of time. Don't worry, we'll do Hamish at some point. Whether this be this stream or another. I just shot a bird out of the sky for no reason. I don't even tend to collect anything from it. Don't mess with my... No, no, for a few years we're related to John the Baptist. I want to see how you go through Red Dead 1 where you did like AC Revelations. Uh, you mean the still gold thing? Yeah, I, I want to. I want to do that. It's just a case of do I have the means to at the moment. Because I don't exactly have access to a last generation console. And Red Dead 1's only on the last generation consoles. <sighs> if they remastered it, it would be ideal, wouldn't it? I mean, I can sort of do it on PlayStation now, but... I've recently got new internet as well, so well a new a new broadband thing, so it could in theory be possible because it's much stronger on Wi-Fi and things. My PlayStation is on that. It could in theory be possible, but I don't know if I want to try it yet. We play a couple missions. Plus, but that negates the point of open world stuff. And also, it's kind of a bit dull, isn't it, when you're just getting about in Arthur's traditional gear. That, whatever that is, no. Much better. This is Arthur Morgan's game, right? I mean... I think it is all supposed to be telling the, the tragedy of John Marston. Red Dead 2 and 1. As opposed to... As opposed to Arthur, really. Shows the tragedy of Arthur as part of the tragedy of 
John Marsden. Now I remember this place, very memorable, Red Dead Online, got scoped out by some random griefer. I will avenge Arthur by dabbing on Micah. Micah will have to avenge the dab by dabbing on Arthur. Story though. Pretty sure Hamish was only one was one of Arthur's only friends. This guy's funny. Well, I didn't mean to point a gun at him. But he chats a bit of shit. Well, let's keep moving. Arthur was more a stepping stone to show the relationship between the gang and John. Yeah, huge character, but... A very good character, too. Poor Maz. Oh my god. Oh. Well done. That's one way to dismount. It's a lot of graves. That one doesn't even have a cross. Maybe it wasn't religious. Who knows? Stump here. Uh, okay. Are you alright, Megatron? You just you just make yourself at home right there. Yeah? You good? Oh, wow. I don't know like playing as Arthur more than John. I mean, I like playing as Arthur probably more as well. But you got to understand that it's not about what you like. It's about the story that they're trying to tell. And the simplest way to put it is they're trying to tell a story with very... Well, they're trying to tell... It's Arthur's perspective in 2, and he's the protagonist of 2 for all intents and purposes. But they're trying to tell the story of... John Marston and how he became what we know in Red Dead 1 and then what they're trying to tell from that is the story of um, you know just it's just the, the Vandalin gang really you know it's not necessarily always specific let's go have a look Coulter just desecrate a grave sure do you think Red Dead Redemption should have been released after 2 nah I think as a prequel it makes sense because you get these wholesome full circle moments that are meant to have an effect that wouldn't happen if it wasn't a prequel. If it was just out of nowhere you'd be like, oh, I don't get it. I do like Red Dead Redemption 1, John, however. So do I. Well, like I'm a horse who shows up around the corner and like, I'm a fucking spastic. Right, where's this saloon? So you said there was a message behind the saloon about Isabeau Katharina Zinsmeister? It's nice and atmospheric, and there's a man that's been knocked out right out front. Now I want to have a look at this one, this uh, this reward poster. Don't I? Don't mind me, sir. So this is what it is. It says missing person poster reward on the 15th anniversary of the disappearance of Princess Isabel Catherine Zinsmeister. The Grand Duchy of Luxembourg is offering a reward of $100 for her safe return to the authorities. The princess disappeared at age five during a royal visit to the United States in June of 1884. She has blonde hair and birthmarks on her right hand and left cheek. If found, please return her to the nearest sheriff's office immediately. She's dead. Anyways, what I find really funny here is I saw a video. I think it was by a YouTuber called 
trippy commentaries saying i think i found the princess and then goes to aberdeen pig farm and says these toys here that are shown in the fences belonging to the princess there's ones that are identical in aberdeen pig farm next to a skull now i look at that and i this sort of backs up why i think it's wrong it's because i looked at that skull and i thought that skull is an adult skull because a at five years old a child would have some of their baby teeth and some of their big teeth which means that they would have had two layers of teeth visible on their skull if they were dead so that kind of kills that theory right in the water but i thought i'd mention that because i see that video that, that video got a lot of traction so three months old as well so i'm sure a lot of people probably have seen it and I, he makes some fascinating videos that guy i like him but i just wanted to say that yeah that, that, that was wrong and that's okay why is the door changed from there to there? Hey. Further back. Give out Dutch. Was it wasn't Mr. Boss for the win? He did no, it wasn't Mr. Boss for the win. Almost certainly wasn't because he would have gone, this is damn fact. This guy was like, is it? I think it could be. This guy was kinda this guy was really genuine about it this guy one this guy thought he'd sort of cracked it genuinely as opposed to mr boss for the win who just goes yeah, i know it's not real but clickbait but that's that's fine i kind of respect that more than anything because in youtube it is a very volatile game and if you and if you can get that sort of thing going then fair enough someone said there'd be a message about the princess back here somewhere and all we'll found is an outhouse with a bed in it and a whole lot of shit. Jesus me. Look at that. That's a lot of shit. It doesn't even look like shit. Old camp locations. Don't worry. We'll do that then. So there's no message back here as I was promised. There is just a Van Horn trading post. However, what we must do is sleep the night. And then we'll revisit Beaver Hollow because it's literally right around the corner. No, just Mr. Boss Lewin. That's your... PSA for the day. I mean, don't trust anyone if they're saying something, but there's nothing to back it up. Personally, I'd recommend there's only one person you can trust when it comes to information about a game, and that is yourself, really. Do your own research. Believe who you want to believe, but in the end of the day, don't trust anyone but yourself. There's no point. Um, because we'll always throw wild theories at you about what we think as opposed to what we know as content creators because we want to make that video interesting, fascinating, unique, exciting, etc. And sometimes that means that might not be necessarily true. Massacre Armadillo, what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> what? Who hurt you, mate? Just ordered this. Is it worth it? Absolutely. Been binge watching your Red Dead Redemption 2 mysteries and really enjoying them. I've been enjoying making them and I've enjoyed making them the entire year that I've been doing it. It has been a year, hasn't it? Sorry, but I need to apply WD-40 to my uh, to my chair and I also need to set up that properly. Oh wow, that's much better. Fuck me. Having it at an actual decent angle. Lovely. You right, lads? How you, how you doing? It's raining. Oh, you right, fellas? Look out. It is me. I can't even trust myself anymore. Can't trust yourself to not clickbait your mind. Beaver Hollow, that is something near Ansberg, isn't it? Really, sort of like this way. I can never get these like audio flashbacks to trigger in my game. I know that they do happen. I saw a video um, titling one of these encounters. I think it must have been like Shirako because he puts titles like this. Where he goes, John Marston sees a deer and remembers Arthur Morgan. And I thought to myself, yeah, but the deer just happened to be there. It was the camp location, wasn't it, really? Now, this place is fascinating. I don't think I've seen this place before. Should I jog my memory? No. Oh, here we... Yes, I do. Now I remember. Okay, cool. This is where one of the fertility statues can be found probably in this box to be fair yep there's the female fertility statue we'll take that and the rest of it is just a gypsy house really well no it's not because it's not it's not moving but you know what I mean 
Maybe the strange man is gathered in disguise. Maybe he is, maybe he's not. God knows. If everyone could share the stream with them, mate, that would be fantastic. Leave a like, hit subscribe if you're new. Wonderful stuff would be absolutely brilliant. If you want to consider becoming a patron, that's up to you. I'll leave that decision with you. Now, what's this place? I wonder. Can we get inside? Get maybe It's a rattlesnake. Don't particularly want... That's why the horses run off. Right. Can't get inside. That's fine. Is the Red Dead 2 is the best video game ever made? I think that's a very subjective question. Uh, do I think? Uh, it's a very leading question, probably above all else. Uh, I mean, I'm always torn between this and The Witcher 3. Put it that way. Five pounds. Really enjoy content. Keep up the good work. Anonymous PLC. Much appreciated for that. Five pounds super chat. Is more helpful than you realise. And I really do appreciate it. Thank you so much. And I'm glad that you enjoy the content. And I will strive to continue to deliver the quality that you like. But this room I'll steal your rice. Uncle Ben's rice gets stolen. Absolutely magnificent. I believe this scroll bar down here only really reads Streamlabs. Who are you? I mean, these are... These are Murphrys. You can tell by the fact that they're sort of brutes. I don't turn my back on a fight. He's unconscious. Truly. This game looks awful on stream. Oh, I'm sorry. Why does it look awful? I'll, I'll look to the subtitles then. It was talking about Megatron. Shouldn't look bad, but then again, it's only a stream, isn't it? So it shouldn't look... Come to the channel. I'm enjoying your life. Fill up the bloody core. It's annoying. Oh, the dead eye core, yeah. The thing is, it's with the bloody... When you use it in a... F I'm going to look at the stream. Someone said it looked awful. It looks fine. I'm compressing it to try to save um, CPU because I noticed some throttling and I've got to reapply thermal paste at some point. That That's literally it. Put him on the horse. Nah. He's been handled. Kiflon members have a birthmark on their cheek. So it is IZK and Thomas Sinclair Kiflon members. What do you mean Kiflon members have a birthmark on their cheek? Like they're all just born with a mark on that cheek and if they don't they can't become Kiflon members. I mean I suppose there's a point there but I don't quite get it. Oh fuck me. Low trees. YouTube compression is not the best. Nothing you can do to make it better. Hmm. Now not necessarily true but not necessarily false either there are things I could in theory do to make it better such as absolutely abuse my PC now this is a Murphy hideout so let's do this looks better on videos Two pound. Did you complete the game 100%? No, I did not. But thank you for the two pound super chat. I really appreciate it, anonymous PLC. It's much appreciated. If you let that guy stab you, he kills you with one hit. And he also takes a load of bullets. It's weird. Take some cover, take some cover, take some cover. I need to get some guns. Much better.
Is this a varmint rifle? Seriously. Seriously, whip out the fucking varmint rifle. That was a good shot. Rare, but good shot. My horse is absconded with my actual good weapon. Okay. You know what? I need a fucking shotgun this time opposed to being stuck with the varmint rifle. I've killed a man with a varmint rifle, that is absolutely amazing, but it's not what's needed. No shot, Fishy. Fire version. I wonder if someone will attempt to remake Red Dead 1 within Red Dead 2 as a mod. Probably. But it would get that would get shut down by Rockstar legally. The fact that someone tried that. Take 2 would go, nah. Well, there was someone who was trying to mod um, Red Dead to PC, right, and uh, take two, I think it was, got involved and went, nah, none of that. Can't be doing it. And I was like, fair enough, it is their game after all. Murphy Brood. There's two mans in here and they're not going to be nice. There's one that's they're there are sleeping. These must be the night watch. The ones that stay up at night. Well I've absolutely pasted this place, haven't I really? I subbed. Much appreciated, man. Let me search this chest. Murphy Brood. Take jewellery. Some change. And Valerian Root. Magnificent. Do you like GTA 5? I mean... I've never been too into Grand Theft Auto, but I've never been against it per se. It's alright. I mean, I prefer Red Dead for obvious reasons. It's a bit more of a... A, a bit less silly, a bit less full on. Although it's still very parody, you know, like... All Rockstar games like this are a parody, bully. Grand Theft Auto, Red Dead, a lot. They're, they're in a parody universe where they're supposed to not be fully taken seriously, necessarily. Um, I feel like this one had, adds a little morality to it, which makes me able to justify playing it and enjoying it a bit more. Easy. So I like core. Right, okay, here's what we're going to do.
What's your favourite gun? The bomb stuff. I, I don't know. Uh, good old sawn off shotgun never goes amiss. There's no one here. Hey, I'm not coping very well with life, my friend. Evidently. He won't send me the message. He won't. Oh no, what a disaster. I've been here for, for years. And nothing. Nothing. So my auto pistols are my favourite sidearms because of the speed. It was like Arthur Morgan, I wish I could still play as him instead of John. There should be a re on PC, right? I reckon they should release like a choose to play as whoever. I've got to listen to him, it won't let me do anything else. Besides remove away. I don't like losing honor, but he's just got cocaine gum on him. Clearly, he chews too much of that. When you use Dead Eye with the semi auto pistols, yeah, you'll have a machine gun. Yeah, I guess, but I also don't guess. This is definitely the camp area, isn't it, from Beaver Hollow Chapter. It's kind of tainted with not so nice that. Definitely confirms that the Murphy Brood have the ability to do some shit. Let's remove this marker, right? Let's pop this marker. Heartlands. Where's Horseshoe Overlook again? Is it north of... Or is it south of? It's south of, isn't it? It's here. I want to hear the voices. Want an assault rifle in Red Dead? No, you don't, because that would ruin it. And you need to have the... It needs to be period specific, doesn't it? Otherwise, it doesn't make sense. I like the fact that nobody's here with an assault rifle. The closest you get is a Gatling gun. Pretty crazy unto itself. We have Maxim guns, yeah, Gatlin, Maxim, whatever you want to call it. I call it, you know, that's enough. You get Dutch's chest in American Venom. Thoughts on people who are upset by the fact that Arthur and John have the same hair. Uh, what do you mean? <laughs> no, I've heard about these people. They go, John's hair is wrong. And yeah, they're, I guess they're sort of right because it's just the same as Arthur's. But well, it's wrong. No, it's wrong. It's like they're a bit mad at it. It's like, no. Are you going to try the 100% one day? I don't know. Probably not. But I appreciate the £2 super chat and all this PLC once more. It's the third time you've done that this stream. I really do appreciate it. Um, it says about 10 minutes ago on here, uh, but it, no, it says a few seconds ago you put it through. No, that's because you must have done it twice. Uh, okay. Or did you complete the game 100%? Are you going to try 100%? Different messages, different super chats. Much appreciated. American Venom is such a badass mission. Indeed, it is. I love it. What weapons do you use? Uh, oh, God. I use. I've got Flaco's revolver here, Micah's revolver there. Usually I go with a, well, usually I go carbine, and then usually I go for a shotgun of some capacity. Usually this one. 
Yeah. Pump action shotgun. There we go. Sure, Freeman is badass one shot kill. Yeah, no, if you point a gun at him, he points a gun at you quicker and shoots you. He's got reactions for days. He just he just messes you up. He's mental. You're alright, Boa. Indeed. I need to find I need what I was trying to do was set up a camp, wasn't it? There's always a goddamn train. Yeah, it's the best part is everything have to do with Sadie. What is everything that had to do with Sadie? Oh, the finding Micah, fighting Micah, and that's what led the Pinker to well, the the agency I think they're called or the bureau is what they're called to find John. So yeah, you get twenty k and not fifty. Yeah, you get twenty thousand dollars from that. Try and snipe Sheriff Freeman. If you do, it works. It's not that difficult. You just need to you just need to wait for him to preach in the square and then you can shoot him from quite a way away. And he will die, but nothing special happens, he's just dead. You doom tumbleweed. Play me know it's doomed. So in theory you change nothing. I could have sworn John or someone saying fifty thousand dollars. Probably used thirty thousand of it to repay the balance of his home. And his family, but that's a lot of money back then, so probably not, but I don't know. Yeah, I know he had leftover money, but the rest of it he used to pay off his home and all that. We'll say you read the room for doing South America, maybe. Hey, that's a nice looking horse you have there. No. You're not talking to me. So hold on, we're talking to you. So I'm going. Just sort of dominoes. That's what I did. Fair enough. Got to shoot someone in the throat. Works because you can hit them in the throat. I don't know if it kills them or if it counts as a headshot or what. Sadie and Charles got the other 30k. Oh, that'll be why. this place it's a ball cool now what's this place That dude was going to race you. Yeah, I know. I don't have time for it. First time he got shot by Sheriff Freeman. You're off on tracks, boys. Me, you, he, and the sirs. Another hermit house. Well, not necessarily, but... For sale. H. Fisher. I'm sure I was told to investigate this place. Yes, I was. Ansberg Broker. That's a new structure, that. You just walk in and habit it. It's just an empty yard. Pretty cool, but ultimately useless.
just a place for sale. So that's what I was talking about on Twitter. Yeah, it's just an empty house. It's just an empty house that happens to be for sale. I think it was being built at one point. Because that's a new building. I know that I'm... I know that I'm property and ranch mod. Yeah. I can't wait to see what kind of mods people come up with. It's going to be fascinating. Albeit maybe a bit more limited than say mods might be for games like Skyrim. Go to Hamish. Plenty of time. Plenty of time on the Hamish front. I was like, Hamish, please. It's like, Hamish, or we run, we break into your house and kill your family. You know. I'm sure you would. <laughs> All over Hamish Sinclair, man. But he wants me dead now. No, I have to run off. Being chased. You've abandoned your sheep just to fight me. Assist me here, boys. I'm sorry, he's chasing me. I end a bow at his sheep and now he wants me dead. And he's got a fast horse, too. One thing for it. That lost me honor. It was self defense, though. No, there's no witness to murder. I'll be long gone. It's not a problem. Someone's bound to make an undead nightmare type mod. Or try to, yeah. Whether or not that would get shut down sort of thing, God knows. That'll go away in a minute, that wanted level. No reason why I should stay when I'm moving so quickly. Use dead eye like ma like in Max Payne, a diving thing. Can you dive and use dead eye in this? I like that about Max Payne, that sort of focus mode. I just see flying unicorn mod. That'll be mad. <laughs> yeah. Cheers for the two pound super chat again, anonymous PLC. It is much appreciated. It does put a smile on my face whenever I see that blue box show up. Though I advise people don't go crazy, crazy with it. Yo, that's definitely not quite a horseshoe overlook, is it? No, because horseshoe overlook is up here. Right, let's go. Not belt you in Tang Sudo Red. Red belt first gup. No, this does put a smile on my face. We're here, boys. Jump me. It's the leftovers of the camp. Trigger it if I'm not mistaken. No, that place is hell. One second. I'll be back in a second. No sign of... No sign of any ghosts while I have my headphones off. I miss having that camp dynamic, like the entire thing. Matabusis Ing. Yo, man, how you been? How goes it? Is there a Tahiti glitch? I'd love to see it. Mm. It's, it's never been a part of the game, so no. The game, we're, we're never going to see Tahiti. We knew that from the start. You can hear the gang singing at this location. Set up a tent. I think we can set up a tent actually at the camp. Yeah, we can set it up literally right here. So it's literally up. Old time's sake thing.
see it's just me back at the horseshoe overlook location camping on my ones reminisce feels like something john would do every year and then it'll be evening ring dang do now what is that the red dead redemption community are very cool you guys are nice thank you jazz booth this is the good old fishy company it is god man how is how's you man standard procedure it's like the good old days Bounty hunters. Why are they after me? I'm not even wanted. Oh, I have I have a bounty. Well, that's not good. In this area, I have a bounty, so let's try and pay it off. Come on, man. Have to go round. I'd rather not cause an. A hiccup and have to pay off more bounty if I can help it. But I can leave my camp behind for them to trace me. <laughs> Not that it'll actually make a difference, they'll know exactly where I am. See? I don't to this it, but in like Red Dead Redemption 1 for me, to be able to shoot my horse on the head while riding it. Right, ignore all that, my I'm a rabble arouser and Dick sees my home. Oh, okay. It me, Grandad Killer Three. They're hunting you over a foot long sandwich. It seems so. This game's atmosphere is fantastic. Yeah. We're about to get an absolute gush of it. Welcome to Valentine. Watch where you're going. What the hell's wrong with you? Cool down. Go to Beach's gut hope or I'll tell Abigail. Please don't tell Abigail. I don't know why. Just don't. Morning. Hello there and welcome. Pay bounty. Liberty is worth every penny. Pay all. Just to be clear, it was all a misunderstanding. No mail to receive. Valentine, Southern and Eastern Railways. And then there's a little map of it. Showing the area. I'm assuming this region is all altogether kind of landlocked a bit. So this is not like the sea, this is a river. And then a ways over here there's another side. And this is this 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 does, however lead out to yeah yeah that's my theory lead out to the sea eventually i'm not gonna steal your horse don't worry okay rob the doctor at valentine why would it i'm sure i've already done that okay where do we go have you been to the doctor's back room in valentine i'm certain that i have but if not, we'll make sure. Another game that gives me good memories is Spider-Man. Oh yeah. Not even moving too much. Yeah, I've done this one. Spider-Man's a good game. It is sure, sure it's a good game. Yeah, yeah okay, my face hurts. It's obviously an Englishman named Gavin. Indeed, they probably have. You know what I want to actually find? Sorry about them. 
I do want to find is... Give me a sec. Hopefully this is enough to fix that white big dot on the wall behind you. What? Oh, which one's that? Oh, that one. Ah. Oh, yeah, well, I don't know. It's just an old room. Thank you very much, Anonymous PLC, for that £5 super chat. It's really appreciated. Though, I think you should probably consider conserving your money now. Uh, let's have a look. Find some Easter eggs that are worth our time. I want to I wanna explore some Easter eggs that are lovely and nice. Roanoke Valley, where is that? It's over here, isn't it? So we want to go here next, because I know that I know what's here. Oh, well, I knew where this was though. To be fair to myself, though I've never actually f this the meteor strike. It struck a struck a house or part of it did, and another part of it struck. Well, well, a, a bit of woodland really, and now there's. A very interesting area. I need to brush the horse at some point. But first things first, I need the horse to actually go through something or over something or. Yeah, finally. It's adventure time. Let's go. Yeah, I should. I'm not Mr. Beast. Exactly, man. Let's put people into a new tax bracket just for giggles. There's donating out of kindness and then there's. Maybe a kind of bit over the top. The feeling of playing a game for the first time is absolutely the best feeling. Oh hell yeah, it is. Magnificent is what it is. Would you consider your channel more if I read the Redemption 2 channel on an AC1? I consider it more just my channel where I upload what I want to. Sometimes I go on bounce about uploading Assassin's Creed videos because Assassin's Creed game will be new. Like uh, next year, I'm sure that'll happen. Or I'll go on bounce about uploading Red Dead videos because I'll find a load of mysteries that I just want to I just want to sink my teeth into. Or maybe I'll just make content I want to want to make because there's nothing really else going on. Or maybe because I get fixated on other games like Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order, sure to get a few videos. Um, the Outer Worlds might do. Not really thought about it yet. I love your Kahoot stream. Yeah, yeah it's great. Why are you doing it? What are you doing there, man? <laughs> There's bloody wolves in that. Let's turn around and help him out, yeah? That is if the wolves don't kill him, which would actually be kind of funny. Find charity. Maybe charity will find you. Okay. Hey, Lindsay. Hey, I was barely had high honor on my first play through the same. Will you make a video about Watch Dogs Legion? Or three, as you put it. Probably. I'll probably enjoy that. Oh, really? That was, that was clever, wasn't it? Megatron. Stop crashing into trees. It's annoying. Joel won't die. Oh, we're talking The Last of Us 2 now, are we? I don't know. I honestly don't know this. I honestly don't know. Best way to put it. I haven't put much thought to it. Really? Really? Stop crashing into things, will you? It's fucking horse, man. It's retarded. M minimum mod because I kill and pillage too much. Yeah, that and true. <laughs> I probably kill and pillage too much as well, to be honest. But I don't. It's funny. What do you mean there's a fire here, though? I shouldn't be there. more like it. 
No, it looks kind of a bit more real estate, doesn't it? Come on, Megatron. You're a good Billy. Yes, Dennis, we all hear you. I love the dog when he just makes noises just because he figured out that he could. He goes, roo, roo, and then he barks at you. <laughs> Daredevil game would be sick. Some had a long chat about ideas for a couple months back. It would be so neat. What's that? So cool. I don't know. Maybe. Do you have Facebook? I have a private Facebook that I don't disclose to my viewers. And I also have a Facebook page. There should be a link in the description. Please keep making more Red Dead Redemption 2 videos. How about this? As long as it's a topic to talk about, I'll keep doing it. This is better than buying V-Bucks on Fortnite. Cheers for that super chat and honest PLC. But I seriously think you should probably consider saving your money. But it is much appreciated. Truly magnificent effort, my friend. But I agree. There's a lot of things better than V-Bucks on Fortnite. Such as fishy on a Sunday night. Dennis is certainly making himself known. He does it. He does it. He just does. There's Hamish Sinclair's gaff. Plenty of time to come back here in a sec. Had to go had to hold the cat before he ran out. <laughs> you heard a roo roo and went, no. You're scaring off you as cats, Dennis. What the fuck are you playing at? Speculating of the game before it comes out is one of the best parts. Oh yeah it is. The graphics is clear on Red Dead Redemption 2 now. Um I don't know. I mean on PC they might be. Welcome to the group sires. Hi, I'm new. Oh, welcome, 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 new. Buy it, to okay. Microwave be like, mmm. Indeed. Is the coat of Vaseline gone? I guess. Yes, it is. That's a bit relevant. Let's have a look. See what how many likes we're on. Out of curiosity. Uh, because it is important to me to figure out how many likes we're on. 170. Let's get to 200 likes, eh? I think that'll be a good idea. There's a FIFA ad here on my stream, which is great. Uh, I don't know about you, but I love FIFA ads. It feels really relevant. <laughs> that house is where I want to be. Let's go. Red the three hopes. Indeed. I don't think Red Dead 3 or Red Dead Redemption 3 is ever going to be a game. I reckon in about a decade or so they'll have another Red Dead entry, but it won't be the same story. It'll be a, it'll be its own thing, and it'll be quite interesting to see what they do, but I don't think they're going to do anything else with that. So the dead people. There's a little bit of dead. I've already made a video on this place, do not worry. Um, you can take a meteorite piece. Do you support the football club? Yes, uh, Exeter City FC. There you go. Hattie Langtree. Fairest flowers, gems of beauty. Layla. Okay, cool. Now. I'm trying to imagine. I'm trying to figure out where's the geography work for. Uh, what looks like a meteor strike. I'm assuming here. Could be wrong. Maybe it's down there. But it broke off here, hit this at this angle. This is the only geographic, you know, area where it could in theory hit. Well, according to the map. Let's go. I might watch The Lion King tonight. Not a bad watch. Yeah. Why not? The Lion King. Circle of life in it. 
Well done. I call that a job well done. Okay. In first person, that was really disorienting. I spent two hundred dollars on a Joker costume and other stuff for my for my costume. That's pretty cool for one night a year. That's a lot of money. Who's got one hundred percent? Gaming. Is that Marco Dragic slap? Lab, lab, lab. Yeah, indeed. Whether the three should be Char Jack, Charles, and Sadie together? I don't know. I get the feeling Sadie didn't last much longer, and Charles was probably too busy with his family. I liked it. Come on, horse. Oh, stay still, stay still. His eyes are clear. There we go. I knew it was up here. Oh, fuck me. Look at all those chickens. Indeed. This is something I haven't yet to make a video about, but I'm aware of its existence. I've done the shack that's been hit by it, but I completely did not mention the fact that there was a bloody crater here. So I'm going to leave this for then. I'm going to leave it until then anyways. I'm not going to faff too much with it. I'm just going to allow it, calm it, and then... Sandini. No, there's nothing in Sandini really. Uh, playing in first Wi-Fi in the first person, I was too disoriented to change it. Uh, okay, where do we want to go? Butcher's Creek. Let's have a look, see what other Easter eggs we can find. Well, I've never done the Jungle Book thing, you know, where there's the, you know, the um, the snake Easter egg. But I know exactly where it is. Never made a video on that one either, but I kind of said I wouldn't as a joke. So I feel like I have to not now. And that makes it so funny. It's also just a snake. So what would I make a video on exactly? All Vandaline gang doing deeds on, that on Halloween. Nice. Greek Greek antagonize, that is really funny, isn't it? I love a good Greek Greek antagonize. Actually, you know what we need to do? Set up camp to do the Hamish Sinclair mission. Can you revisit the strange man's house? I'll do that, don't worry. It'll probably look the exact same as it did in the video, though, because, I mean, this is a different save. I killed you for it. How many bullets do you take, man? Not sure what happened there. Thought that would be calm, but no. Was not calm. Arthur is way more funny antagonizing. Yeah, that's because Arthur uses his words and cares about what he says. <laughs> He's a very intelligent guy, Arthur. A big day with a bot. Uh, yeah. I'm going to say yeah. You want to know why? Because he's a bot. When you're in Arthur gameplay, you just need to overwrite save data. Don't worry, when it comes out on PC, it'll be all good. I'll get to about chapter 4 and then not bother anymore. Probably. Because it'll be more fun to, you know, get about as Arthur. Supposed to get about as anything else. 
and then I'll start a new game on PlayStation 4. If I want to do a graphics comparison, it will be through cutscenes and those bits. That way I know that I can simulate the same conditions of environment and things like that. John can't swim, hee hee. And John's like, no, I can't swim. <laughs> it's funny for him. Yeah, do you got Snapchat? Uh, type exclamation mark Snapchat as one word, see if it works. Uh, because it should tell you the Snapchat. <sighs> what are the specs of your PC? Okay, so it's an Intel Core i7 4790K. A bit old, but cool. 16 gigs of RAM. Um, NVIDIA GTX 1080 Ti. Uh, the rest of it I really don't see how it's relevant. <laughs> just, just, it's got a couple monitors obviously. Beyond that it's all the same. It's just a, it's just a nice little machine. Hey, mach ah. Come in. <laughs> so, you said we might go out on a hunt? I did. There's this huge she-wolf stalking me the last few nights I've been out but she can, I can bet Dutch tried throwing John in rivers to try to teach him how to swim yeah hey, so what do you do hey? yeah the kind face the kind of like the punch <laughs> the north spend a lot of time out west funny I never saw myself as a wanderer what happened then what Across the whole field without your boots touching mud. Those were bad times. Yes, they were. Oh, they were telling a story. Would you like small coffee? <laughs> Please. At least not to. F Do you stream often, bro? Uh, I try to, but not as often as I'd like, maybe. Come on. I need to. I need to wash this bastard. This is not going to go well, you can tell. How do you finish the skin of wolves? They're gonna be perfect, just saying. Could be. Get the blood set. Let me take a look. No, it's fresh. Pretty fresh, anyways. I'd say. Can I kill bull? Bull. Yeah. That was her dinner. Clean everything you have, Christ, like this. I'm going to clean my pump action shotgun. My guess. It's on somewhere over there. There's a whole lot over. Some 
Get off throat soothers. What's up with the wall beside you? Uh, it's fucked probably. Might get some more acoustic foam and put them up as well. Can I just turn out? Complete and unconditional. I don't think the wolves would have showed much mercy. That's quite an ambush she let us into. It's a bushwhacking, I'd call it. Huh? Where is it? God damn! Over here! Over here! Oh. Remember that it didn't. You know how the say the Hamish side missions end, don't you? Yeah. Well, like Hamish just wants to get killed by animals. Good wolf pelt is what that is. It's not on there. Look at that creature. I might like start to um, skin these guys. Little funny joke. Funny other also thought I'm not hungry for grandpa today, I'm hungry for some dumbass. Poor wolf pelt, okay, there's no point in no point in bothering with those then. Right, okay, where do we want to go now? As I guess I guess and I can only guess is this guy so we've got a track ahead of us now to sell this pelt let's save while we have the time enjoy the film Igor see ya All right, I'm gonna go watch the Lion King alright take it easy Igor
if I recall, there'll be a there'll probably there's another Hamish mission to do, and that's Hamish sorted out. There is a mansion south of Van Horn. I'm aware of it. If you're on about, which one is it? Is it the one with the man bear pig, or is it the other one where there's the guy that you can you can try to rob? He's beautiful. Well, while well, he's a really good horse. Well, what I'll do when when it comes to getting beautiful is I'll I'll probably put him in a stables. Really, it was so smooth until the horse decided to do that side sweep. Don't forget to leave a like on the stream, share with your friends, hit subscribe if you're new, that would be magnificent. That's not the way to go, fuck it. Oh, okay. That is. Sorry, for a moment there I thought I saw something, I didn't. I wonder, you know that guy who streamed, um, that guy who has a video, a clip of like a UFO showing up in a field and nobody else has ever seen it? Which happened more or less around the time the game released. I'm curious as to how they triggered that. Because I'm generally concerned about AC2020, I can't sleep, it's shaking my head. I, w I wouldn't lose sleep over Assassin's Creed, ever. I got Bejul doing my Arthur playthrough, which probably wasn't the best time to get him. Oh god. Just imagining the ending, but it's Buell. Oh, that's actually really immersion. That's like really emotional, so it's probably better for the story. My tiny brain is excited for Watch Dogs Granny. Yeah, it's allowed to be. Watch Dogs Granny could be quite funny. Hacker Granny. Gr Gracker? No. Gr gr granny Hacks. What is the best game you guys have played for me? It's The Walking Dead. I love that game. Uh, either this or The Witcher 3. Oh, I'm fatigued, I'm telling you. It's been a long day. I love The Walking Dead. The ending got me. The good old ending thing. Where everything occurred, even the gaming. The gaming. Who's our, who's the art is this? Let's board it up. I can't get in. Oh, that's shit. Go back to the ranch and mock uncle. Imagine. Please make a video about your top AC open worlds. Uh, I don't know. Doesn't strike me as a video I'd enjoy making, so it's probably best that I don't. There are some videos which um, people ask me to make, and I think I wouldn't enjoy a second of making that. Because it seems like a bland video that I wouldn't be able to enjoy. It just it would just not be good, right? Simple way to put it. Oh no! It's this man. Wanna take the weight off? Fire's good and hot. Hey. Me casa, casa, yes, go stand on the fire. Hey, 
with you. So you got a girl, mister? Uh, I wouldn't call her a girl. Me neither. Got my eye on one, though. I was hunting north of Vannisburg when I came across this cabin. And there's no one there but this woman. Bit bony, but beautiful as the day is long. Real elegant fancy type, too. Uh-huh. I see how you like them, too, friend. Don't know what she's doing out there in the middle of nowhere, but turns out she's a widow. She asked me to leave, but in a real nice way. M made me feel good. I watched her from the bushes for a while. This is Charlotte Malfour's stalker, by the way. I could really hang my saddle. A hot dinner and warm bed every night. Mm, don't sound bad to me at all. All right, I need to cool down a bit. You know, I can't. Have we met before someplace? If you ever figure it out, be sure to let me know. Mm -hmm. I lost honor for that. Even though the man is quite clearly a sadist. Of the worst capacity. As shown by all these pictures of naked women. And drawings and all that. And of course if you look around you see fucking handcuffs. Now. I don't know about you. But. Maybe just a little bit fucked. Maybe ever so slightly. It's like he steals women's stuff. And then just goes yep. Nice. Better have a letter on you or something worth my while. Here's what I do. I, okay, I finish a game with high honor and then I just ruin the honor doing loads of shit. Fishy, Ben Parker, how you doing, mate? <sighs> Young Ben Benishikt. Well, I die. Oh, mate. Okay. Cool, I don't, I don't understand it, but uh, yeah. All right. How many people are we on? We're on a few. I said that's a rocket. I'm surprised I didn't get launched off it. It's good old Ben Parker shows up on occasion. Shows up every, every, every time the planets align in the perfect line, and then leaves. Of course, Murphy's are always in town. Let's go night folk hunting, fishy. I can't think of anything that I'd rather not do. Well, anything that I'd rather not do more than that. Because the night folk come at you. I mean, they come at you, they try to. They attempt to immediately overwhelm you, which is why when you fight them, you usually wind up getting stabbed and killed. Challenge, don't use Dead Eye. Well, I mean, if you've got aim assist on it, shouldn't be a problem. But with the night folk, it's impossible. Put it that way. You give me anxiety riding so close to the trees, lol. No night folk, we need to go skinner hunting. You know what we need to do? Sell this fucking wolf pelt. I haven't survived all encounters with them. Well, congratulations, you're officially god.
Is Mayo an instrument? Uh, depends on how you use it. You could, in theory, make a bottle of mayonnaise with a bit of mayonnaise in it sound like a musical instrument and use it in music. But it, whether or not it sounds any good is another question. Saint-Denis, welcome. The last airbender was good. The last bender... Rob the Ghost Lady video and Strange Man video. So many other videos. Keep up the great work, mate. Cheers. Thank you for your support. It really means a lot to me. Do 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 do. Doyle's Tavern. Usually has something of a rat issue. Well done. The shop is closed at this time of day. Well, why is he stood here then? You ever thought of that? Then here's your chance to do Greek re antagonize. You're right. It is my chance. First things first, allow me. Sell those, sell that. Horse cargo, that will get me a dollar, that's cool. Thanks Hamish, very useful. What do you mean disturbing the peace? Well, that was. Greek Greek antagonize is a big problem. Hey, watch out. Oh, watch. Hey, partner. Hello. How'd we end up here, huh? You sure? Well, you must have been turned out of everywhere else. Mm -hmm. Well, it does appear as if I sold all of that, I'll get a bit of money. Mm. Sold all of that, I'll get a bit of money. If I sold that, how much money would I get? 30? Might as well. They're only curiosities like that. My valuables. Uh, that'll give me a solid wow. grand. That'd give me 50. One, seven. That's great, there we go. Look at all that money that I just earned. It's magnificent is what it is. Just trying to see man harassing a woman. Seems about right, right? I just collect loads of gator eggs. I like to do, I like to do things I don't make want to kill people. I've disturbed the peace again. Right, there's one way to deal with this, and it's called leaving town. <laughs> Out of the damn way! 
Yeah, you went straight into me. Jesus Christ. Jesus fucking fuck. Okay. My perfect wolf pelts are only 150, which is one of the worst pelt prices. Yeah. yeah. Del Lobo hunting in New Austin. Just found a channel, but I already think you're going to do great later on YouTube. Keep up the hard work. Thank you very much. I do like to think this is the later, because I've been doing this for six years. What weapon loadout do you personally use, Fishy? Uh, well, a stick, typically. If you're talking about me personally using a weapon, it'd be a stick. Also, just surrender. Yeah, but I accidentally murdered a woman. And it counts as a murder, because there's no such thing as manslaughter in this game. Skinner hunting, please, please, please. Well, I mean, look at the time, man. And a burp, I apologise. That's all this salad, it's making me very happy, man. I like watching my own videos with subtitles on because the subtitles kind of hear me very well. It's great. It's weird as well watching it when you're the one speaking. Right, where did it come from? How did I even get up here? Oh, no, I am in Sudbury. I thought I was in Van Horn. I was very confused. Is this the market? No, it's not. It's a real random yard. Boot and shoe manufacturer. That is the market. And going through there is how to get yourself arrested. Now, I hope you don't mind if I borrow this as I have an adventure to take it on all the way up to... Can we, can we agree to move in a direction? This is mine. Listen, it's important that I borrow this. I hope many men understand. Fucking traffic, man. Time for an epic journey. If, if I don't crash, I might as well steal another one of these at this point. Well, this turned out really badly. I need a bigger carriage. I need your carriage. Let me on. Oh, I'm already on the carriage. That's pretty cool. <laughs> I'm sorry. This carriage is bigger. That's why it's necessary. I also need to keep whistling to keep the horse following. Yeah, put me down. I feel like they've shot one of the wheels. John has every right to hate something, eh? They don't even let you steal wagons. Imagine cops shooting you for stealing a wagon. America, fuck yeah. 
It appears as if American cops followed the model of Saint Denis. Can you blame them? I sure can. I should have stolen a wagon closer to this place. Because now I'm stealing one and taking it across the world just to get into Mr. Black and Mr. White's house. Watch it not work, is my theory. to go for a minute. When I go back and someone tell me what I missed and me whistling forever for my fucking horse to show up. Like a fucking maniac. All the gang hates something here except Tilly, I guess. Yeah, I suppose. Tilly lives there. After the Vandalin days. Not necessarily love for the place, but of love for who she met there. So, can you blame her? I mean, it's not a bad place. It's kind of atmospheric. It's kind of cool. Not massive either. Not tiny. Either way to make money, in my opinion, is to steal like is to sail wagons. Ambience music. Who doesn't love a bit of ambience music? Welcome back to John Whistling for two minutes. Now with less whistling. No, the I need the horse to keep following me, otherwise getting the horse back is gonna be a pain in the neck. That whistling is killing me, I'm sorry, it needs to be done. M Mr. Steal your nun shall claim your nun. Oh, wet spaghetti. Thanks for the £2 super chat. I much appreciate it. It's been a while since I've seen you in chat. Welcome back. Might I add. The horse will not follow unless I keep whistling, is my logic. Make that a five minute. Make it five years. Because you just know that we really appreciate the content, at least I do. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. A load. <sighs> well, the horse just dipped hot dog in milk. Okay. And did you learn anything from that random experiment? If you stop building, it will follow you, I think. Yeah, it's following me now. Gotta make sure though. There you go. Keep following Megatron. It's how my Xbox broke, I'll be playing right now. It's alright, you've got fishy to watch. There are worse things to do for sure. This wagon is stolen, but this is before the days of insurance, so what would you know? Or number plates, actually. I think the only. It only needs the whistle, one whistle to follow, does it? Because sometimes it requires constant whistling, it just depends. What's going on, mate? Love him or hate him, he's whistling straight facts. Why does John Marston feel so different compared to Red Dead Redemption 1? Because it's a different game that's eight years younger, I guess. I like the whistle just to make sure that he's still following. But we're already at Valentine, so what's the worst that can happen? That was great, well done. It's 
now a big red splodge on that tree where this horse's lit lack there of brains was. See more angry and red dead one compared to the epilogue, John. I guess it's because he's under a lot more duress than in the epilogue. There we go, so he's following now. Cool. So all that matters, what happened to Charles and Sadie? Charles went north and sometimes comes back down and Sadie... Uh, well, I think sometimes comes back down because he can sometimes run into him post the ending. And Sadie, God knows what happens to her, she's crazy. She's probably gone south ways, that's my theory. Charles went towards a life of peace, Sadie went to the vital one, I guess. Guess overtaking before the bridge is a great idea. Who is your favourite YouTuber of all time besides the Epic Game allows Tyler, James and George myself then, obviously. I am my favourite YouTuber, I don't spend much time watching YouTubers, I just make the content. So I honestly don't have an answer for that and I ran something over them nicely. How far away are we? Oh god, Jesus fucking Christ. Okay, well, we're nearly there, by comparison to how far we've gone. So you went to South America. There you go. I just, I just find it funny whistling a lot. See, it reminds me of Red Dead Online where your horse will just fuck off if you don't. And it stresses me out. Because in Red Dead Online, your horse, you'd have to whistle about 20 times, otherwise your horse wouldn't show. Those turns don't need to occur. Don't rob me, sirs. Is Batch's bridge repaired by the epilogue? Yes. I believe it is. Charles went to Canada and said he went to South America. Indeed. This will probably be the absolute pinnacle of the stream, by the way, finding out what's in the uh, what's in the yard. For Mr. Black and Mr. White. This is the absolute pinnacle of my life. I've borrowed two horses and that's a, uh, that's a bit, nah. John is not the father, apparently she went to the cave and drank herself to death. Who's she? Welcome to Karen. Oh, okay. I'll have a look, see what I can find. Karen became a drunk, but the game never says. Yeah, I don't think it does. Charles went to Tahita. Charles went to Fajita. Will you buy the PC version of this? I've already pre ordered it. Are excited for the PC release? Yes. Okay, we're nearly there now, boys. I can feel my success. Four or two horses gave one brain damage. It's alright, didn't use it much anyway. Just needs to know how to walk in a straight line, or whatever line I choose to make it walk in. I thought someone's Arabian and read that online without them noticing lol. Oh Jesus Christ. Did you manage to stable it? Can you stable someone's Arabian and read that online? How 
how far away is this place now? Jesus Christ, it's further away than I thought it was. See, by now I'm expecting it to be around any corner. It's just not. This is the point where the horses get freed and the wagon breaks and then I can't move it. Stop it. God damn it, horses. Oh, wow. It's great to it just to follow you. Cheers, man. I appreciate it. Watch it not work now. Watch this be a wasted trip and I'll cry. I'll cry tears of sad. Should in theory be fine. Well, this is this is going off to a great start. It's not really an optimal shape for this kind of. No, I want to climb onto this. Tell you what. No, don't don't climb onto the, no, don't climb onto the. I'm trying to climb into the fucking back, you moron. What if Gavin's in there? Then we cry at Gavin. Come on, do it, do it, do it. Do it. <sighs> no, the truth. This will do it. Nope, these morons, they're fucking retarded and they don't. So peasants. The ladder is there, but it's just not usable by us. right under it ah oh, yes done it boys we're in it's one bed in here okay well this was this was really worth it wasn't it I don't know about you but this was this was yeah it's my home now This is after all where I live now. Let's sleep until morning. This is a bit Malbus building to enter the unique Malbus. Hey, then have you ever watched a TV show called Firefly? It's the best sci fi show. No, I haven't. Poor postman pet. How will he ever deliver the letter now? I have to throw it. Postman. Let's go. It was really disappointing getting in and finding nothing. Let's be honest. This is my home. My humble abode, a sacred oasis. Oh, where's the fucking wagon? Oh, it's there. Okay, cool. Just make sure it never leaves. Come on. That's when you know. Where's my horse? Cool. Well, we're here now. This is our home. Yeah, well, I guess this concludes the stream, because... You didn't try shooting the ladder down. Fine, the fish's voice can't leave when he swears, the same. What do you mean shooting the ladder down? Is it possible? Is it? Now the place is on fire, well that's great. Now I'm going to die in a fire. 
Nope, it doesn't seem to work. It's just the place is on fire. It's cool. It's calming. <sighs> Wonderful. It's all part of the plan. It's all. It's all going to be fine. Okay. So I guess that concludes our little stream. Burn the house down. That's a terrible idea. Nobody will listen to this guy. He has no clue. It's fucking mental. Let's not get violent. So, thank you all for coming along to this stream. I hope you've enjoyed. Be sure to go, uh, go to the little house. There's a secret legendary horse. What? Go to the little house. There's a secret legendary horse. The little house. What little house, might I ask? Because I'm pretty sure that there is not a, a little house. So, the one next to the O'Driscoll's camp. I don't even know where the O'Driscoll's camp is, mate. But there's plenty of time, plenty of streams in which we can have a look for these. Um, right now, I need to conclude because I, otherwise, I'll be just causing a disruption. So, thank you all for coming along to the stream. Hope you enjoyed. Be sure to go ahead, leave a like, subscribe, share the channel with your friends, and all that wonderful stuff. Um, if you want to become a patron, that would be super appreciated. And there's loads of cool stuff down there as well which is uh fantastic um there's loads of extra content and things like that i think it's worth your while but regardless i'm here blah well we're about to wrap up but i'll probably be back streaming soon enough sooner rather than later with any luck until then uh goodbye